The Thai audience watched in awe as Mayuko Kamio performed her debut show for Bangkok last Thursday night. She was accompanied by the Bangkok Symphony Orchestra and Japanese conductor Chikara Iwamura. Conducting an orchestra composed of over 30 instruments, with each having its own life, is no easy task. We had the privilege, as conductor Chikara Iwamura shares his wisdom and experience on what goes through his ears and even his heart. Is, is this your first time in Thailand? Yes, exactly. Uh, my first trip in uh, South Asia, uh, Thailand. Not only Thailand, but uh, this Thailand is first visit this time. Yeah. Bangkok, wonderful city, yes. Bangkok Symphony Orchestra, my, let's say BSO. Yes, I know the name itself, but uh, uh, I don't have experience to conduct this orchestra and uh, I don't know the atmosphere or, or what, how members or just Thailand people or uh, another foreigner etc etc I didn't know anything but uh, uh, this week Sunday Sunday night I had first rehearsal for our concert uh, Sunday evening and uh, we read the Borjak Symphony and uh, Verdi, Italian uh, composer, uh, his uh, overture. The first rehearsal, just three hours, but uh, very, very good, much quality. And I'm very surprised and uh, I was very happy. And also, member is very, how do you say, very musician, full of musicianship. When we have good rehearsal, and uh, the conductor if can switch on their some uh, their heart uh, it will function i know score itself is just signification just some symbol of the notes or some some volume for the piano or tempo is changing Accelerando, I mean, go ahead, or retardando, slow down, etc. Just simple. But we musicians have to create from these symbols what, what is hidden under the symbol or with what we have to do for um, give the audience for some, how do you say, vibration of their heart etc etc so this is very hard work but a very how do you say very exciting how do you feel when music touches your heart the feeling is very sometimes from music very clearly pushed or touch my heart there it is a very clear moment oh this is music or music says something very clearly if in that case, it will be very simple to um, request something to the orchestra members. Oh, here is very special moment for uh, how do you say for tempo changing or some volume changing. So let's do this is accent or this is very clearly um, simple to easy to request them. But uh, in other case, music is very how do you say very intimate, very inside of the heart, uh, each, each member's heart. In that case, it is very difficult to explain by words. Language itself is some, it has vocabulary, but uh, music itself, not under the vocabulary. Uh, instead, as I told you, some atmosphere or some changing of the speed of respiration or some harmony, harmonies, color, etc., etc. The music is very difficult to express by voca uh, vocabulary. It will be the language of the worldwide. All people over the world 
can understand by music. Because, uh, for example, now my country, Japan, is very hard situation after the earthquake. And uh, I had a big concert after just one week after the, the earthquake in the West Japan. And people were so, so sad and so, how do you say, um, upset in this situation. But uh, I tell the audi- told the audience the situation and uh, let's listen to carefully the music itself. And I believe music itself can encourage all Japanese people or all worldwide people by itself, music itself. Because music is a language from heart. As all forms of art do, music imitates reality in a world of its own. Though it cannot be seen or touched, its existence is undeniably present. Like a feeling, like a taste. Much like life, music has its highs and its lows. The language of emotions waiting to be learned and explored. Not the corn bloody reporting for ASEAN Newsroom.